think I've had a really good time here. We just had a lot of fun. We had big laughs and our counselors were absolutely hilarious. There's so many fun things like archery, climbing tree, field, the giant swing. At first, you seem like it's nothing, and then when you get on it, it you feel so free. It's been healing and it's been a break. It's been a breath of fresh air, uh, literally a breath of fresh air. Usually at your regular home, you don't really learn about God as much as you do here and you don't get to go on hikes really big, like here. <laughs> as you really long around. hikes. And I think um, at Forest Home, there's no distractions. It's just you're secluded, you're in, like you're outdoors, and there's no cell phones or TVs or anything. Like, it's just you and God, basically. I know you can picture someone in your mind that maybe isn't that different, but maybe a little bit different. And I want to challenge you to stick up for them. Let him in your crew. I think I'll remember when Sam Piper said that even 2,000 years ago, Jesus was praying for us. Oh, that yeah, really stuck yeah. out. That was weird how Jesus knew what our name was going to be and when we were going to be born. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> it, it should actually go longer. It seems like just a week is just enough to scratch the surface, to break away that, that hard shell, and just get them melted down to where, where they can be molded, and then they're back home. The big thing changing in my life would be um, prayer, I guess. I think because when they talked about prayer, it just hit me, and I think that's really going to change on me when I hit home. You know what? There's so many friends I've made up here. There's so many I can't count. God above all the world in my